Uh, yeah, Growler, I was right. Um, hello everyone, uh, Trigon here. I actually, uh, was not ready to start recording. I was swimming around looking for salt so we could make some, uh, disinfected water. Um, oh, we got the radiation suit blueprint for free. Oh, that's nice. But then the warning that the Aurora was blowing up went off, so I thought, uh, I, I, guess, I guess I better start recording the next episode. <laughs> Anyways, welcome back. We are playing Subnautica once again with Growler, who does not like being here. Um, but if you like being here, pickle that thumbs up button for us. And if you haven't already, please subscribe. So let's go ahead, and what do we got here now? So now we've got radiation suit, we need two lead and two fiber mesh. Fiber mesh, I think we might actually already have. I'm surprised we haven't picked up any lead. Usually I see a ton of the stuff. A laser cutter. I just picked up a cave salt for a moment ago. But I did pick up a lot of the filter fish things, so... I can at least get some water out of them. Just one or two filter fish things. There we go. <laughs> okay, so our water is back up to safe levels. Let's see what this radio message is. This is Avery Quinn of Trading Ship Sunbeam. Aurora, do you read? Over. Still nothing. These old Terra ships, they run out of engine grease. They send an SOS. You offer to help, they don't pick up. Aurora, I'm out on the far side of the system. It's going to take more than a week to reach your position. Do you still need our assistance? Over. I'll try them again tomorrow. So it's day so four. Scan picks up in the meantime, damn charter's going to have us wasting our profit margin running errands for Altera. Ladderfish. Which makes it sound far less appetizing when you use that name. Okay, so I think we got the stuff here to make our grav ball at least. Need a battery. What about making? We don't even have. We don't even have a what's your uh, a habitat tool yet? Habitat builder yet? We're gonna need gold. We got silver. More copper. Oh my goodness, we haven't even found any silver yet. Okay, let's. What did we need for that thing? Battery? Let's get some acid mushrooms and get that battery made. Okay. There we go. Now we can do this. Let's come out here. Drop this guy right here. <laughs> All you guys sucked on into our trap. Grab you. Come back here. I don't know why this game insists on rearranging my hotbar every time I play. Come on. Come back here. Come here. You are food. Stop swimming away from me. Possibly that's why he was swimming away. That? I don't remember ever seeing one of those before. What the heck is that? A whole fish. That's new. New creature discovered. I want you. I want you. Oxygen. All right, well, this thing, it did its job, so let's go ahead and quit with that for now. I think we may need... I think we're actually going to end up having to build ourselves a, a storage thing, too. Hopefully we have room for doing a storage thing. No, 
we don't. Oh dear. Uh, let's just put the grab wall out, I guess. That'll free up space in our inventory. Then we'll build ourselves a waterproof locker. Right there. Now we can dump some of this extra stuff in here. Extra fish. Alright, cool. We're in good shape there. Now we'll grab. Oh, we're gonna need. We're gonna need even more, aren't we? So we can get rid of this grab trap. I don't really want to carry it around in my inventory. All right, all right, all right. So that just went boom. So the next question is, what should we do next? It's just that. We really need to get ourselves a habitat builder built. That we're gonna need silver and more copper, a lot more copper. Copper hasn't been too hard to find, but silver is going to be a nuisance. I think we need another locker, though. Oops, I hate to say it. Oh, I need four, not three. Why did I think those were three? So, we need to find ourselves some silver and some copper. And possibly not hit the uh, wrong button again. There, got that in there. You know, I think something else we need to do is we need to make an extra battery. I think we had a copper in here, didn't we? Oops, we don't want the label. I don't want the label. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Let's make an extra battery, because we're probably going to run this Sea Glide out of battery power pretty quick. And until we can get the constructor, we're not going to be able to make ourselves a habitat. Oh, driving me nuts that that got moved to a different different thing. Okay, so let's see. Ships that way. We don't want to go towards the ship. Let's go this way. And of course the sun's going down. Alright, so I am going to go and look for silver. Which... With my experience recently, this is going to take a long, long time. <laughs> and I will bring you back either when I get all the silver we need or when something different happens. Ooh, that's interesting. Very purple. All right, be back in a bit. Still on the hunt for silver ore. I managed to find a couple. Boy, they've just made that so rare and it's needed for practically everything. That is the major stumbling block, but I found this. We don't need that. I don't need any of the mobile vehicle-based stuff. Is that anything useful? I don't know. Repair this. We're going to be out of air. I swear I'm spending... I've already used up our first battery. I swear I'm spending more time swimming up to the surface for air and back again than I've spent actually searching seconds. for silver. Because, you know, it seems like all the places where there's silver are fairly deep. At least when you don't have anything more than a sea glide and uh, a standard air tank, they're deep. 
But I thought, bring you back to explore this. Another one of those, we don't need that. Don't need that. There's really nothing in here we need, is there? <laughs> A locked door we can't get through, another locked door we can't get through. Some chairs and stuff. Well, that wasn't terribly exciting, was it? Sea glide fragment. These are all early fragments, which is great. Did we get anything out of... We got two blueprints since I last looked. 30 seconds. Cooked boomerang. That was it. The cooked, cooked and cured boomerang. Uh, uh, uh. Alright. Um, let's get up here. Head back over to the house. So I should have enough silver to make one item, and I'm not sure what we should make. I have enough to make one wiring kit. Yeah, it takes... You know, I don't know, you know, they, they redid the recipes a few months ago. I think it was back when we were recording last time. And it was great, because um, all of a sudden, you could, you could pretty uh, reliably know if I go to this... This outcrop, I'm going to get one of a couple of different resources. And all the resources you needed for making things uh, were readily available. In fact, I think they changed a lot of this stuff to use gold instead of silver. Um, but they've gone back to needing uh, silver on a lot of it. And it seems like there's less silver available than ever. And the resource deposits they're in also spawn gold and lead so you end up with a ton of gold and lead uh you end up with three or four times as much gold and lead as you end up with silver and that's the one you actually need so aurora this is sunbeam again we just picked up a massive debris field at your location really i didn't know how bad oh neither did we how many of... I, I mean the ship looked more or less attacked so what was the debris field we're now en route to your location we're gonna bring you home well, it did until it exploded. Out. What else can I say? We're a six-seater, and we aren't even slightly equipped to handle this. Your, your microphone's on. Hey, 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 Sunbeam? Sunbeam, your, your microphone is on. Open mic! Oh, my God. Okay. Okay, so, let's see here. Uh -huh. Tools. I want to build a habitat builder. Uh, didn't I just make a wiring kit? Maybe I didn't. So we need a computer chip. That shouldn't be too hard. And a wiring kit. We're going to need more batteries, too. We can use that dead battery to make that, though. That's a nice thing there. Okay, so wiring kit. And that. I think all I need is to get some table coral. Yeah. For us to make a uh, computer chip. Already got some gold on us. Yeah, I felt pretty lucky. I, I found a total of three uh, of the right resource deposits. I don't remember what they're called. Sandstone. I think it's sandstone. Found a grand total of three of them, and two of them had silver. So that was, that was a stroke of luck. No, I found four, because I got one lead, one gold, and two silver. But maybe they've changed how much each thing spawns. Alright, cool. So now... ...is designed to construct habitats capable of withstanding extreme environmental conditions. Let's get some food cooked up here. Oops. Uh, now we can make the advanced wiring kit. Okay, well, cool. Don't want an advanced wiring kit, but I'm glad we can make it. That's all our water, but as you can see, I picked up five salt. Now we can do two things with salt. We can cure the the fish meat so it'll uh, stay fresh longer. Um, it's indefinite, as far as I know. Or we can get some coral, and we can make bleep out of it. Should be one salt and one coral for one bottle of bleach. And then we can use the bleach to disinfect water. Let's 
Bleach is an essential chemical used for cleaning wounds and purifying water. Speaking of cleaning wounds, we should probably get a first aid kit out of the first aid kit fabricator. I thought that was sort of a stupid step too, and I thought they were going to. Will help ensure against dehydration. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Thanks. I I'm trying to talk to people. Would you mind? Thanks. Okay, there we go. <laughs> um, I don't even know what I was saying now. Oh, uh, yeah, I thought they were eliminating the multiple, you know, the rabbit hole steps and doing stuff. But you still, you make a bottle of bleach, and then that's the only component to, for, for making water. <laughs> you would think, if nothing else, one bottle of bleach ought to get you more than one bottle of water. Oh, we got another message. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Message from Aurora Live Pod 13 coordinates attack. Live Pod is carrying high priority passenger. Yoki Kassar. I said Kassar. Why do I have to record this anyway? Send immediate burial detail. <laughs> That was, that was odd. Uh, why do I have to record this anyway? Well, we're not going to go get your corpse right now, buddy. For one thing, I don't think I can get down that deep, and it's a kilometer away. Uh, all right, well, I don't have a light on. I need to make a flashlight, too. Uh, where on earth is our, our storage boxes? Where they, there they are. Okay, what's in this one? That's just got that in it. This has got this in it. Okay, so let's start off with this. So first things first. Can't build that yet. Let's build this. Will that work? We'll see. We'll put a hatch on it. Yep. Then if we put a straight section... Actually, do we... But that needs two glass. We have enough course to make some glass, don't we? I like having windows. Where's our boat? There it is. Picked up a bit of... Uh, quartz when I was out. Let's see. There we go. Yeah, we can make two glass. Uh, what are we going to need to make solar cells is the next question. Two quartz, which we now we don't have. One copper and two titanium. Okay, so I just need to get more quartz out. There we go. Okay. So we're going to be able to put a solar panel on it. And then we will have a basic habitat here. Okay, Let's see a solar panel. Am I going to be able to put this up here even? Is it not going to let me place it because of reasons? Because I can't swim up above it to look down on it. Just because I wanted a, a surface thingy. Can we make a foundation to place this on? We need two lead. We don't have two lead. <laughs> You've got to be kidding me. I can't do this because I can't. All right, fine. Whatever. So it looks like we're going to have to put this at surface or at below the surface level. Because it's difficult. Because it wants to be difficult, apparently. Alright, this looks like a good enough spot. What do you think? Let's face our door towards the life pod. That'll make our lives a little bit easier. Alright, good enough. Put 
this guy right here. And we'll put a solar cell right on top. That's interesting that it didn't make any sounds when we did that. Oxygen. Emergency power only. Oxygen production offline. Oh, there's no sunlight for it to gain power, that's why. <laughs> that's the bad thing about building it at night. Okay, so now let's take a look here. To build this, we're going to need two more silver and two more copper. But then we'll be able to charge our batteries at least. Okay. That can't do anything yet. Oh, sun's coming up. It's got power. Let's go in our little our little base. Power restored. We'll All actually be able to put some life. real storage in here too. That'll be helpful. Actually, you know what? They did change it. I like they changed these wall lockers. The wall lockers only require titanium. They don't require glass or, or quartz. I think they used to require quartz and the big ones required glass. Now they're just titanium and the big ones require just quartz. Okay, yeah, let's... Can I put two more in here? Figures, I just finally broke down and built those... Built those uh, other ones that I don't like, the, the floating lockers that I don't like. And now we're finally able to get these. So, let's see, I'm going to make this our titanium locker. I don't know why the large lockers don't have labels, that would be nice. Uh, we'll make this our copper locker. They're both going to be mixes, but then this will be quartz. And this will be other. Alright, so we've got some storage in here now. Transfer some of this other junk in there. Uh, we'll just leave that there for now. Wish we could recycle those and get some materials back. Would be nice. I didn't want in there. I want it in here. Okay, we'll leave the fish in here because we've got to come in here to do that stuff. But we're going to take all of this stuff and put it downstairs. All the goods we need for manufacturing things. Put that in there for right now back up and get it in a minute. Titanium. Excellent. We'll put all this stuff in here. Sadly, we don't have enough of it to worry too much about it. Quartz. Oh, yeah, I forgot each one of those made two water. Oh, man, we got water last just for a while now, don't we? So, one quartz. Well, that's great. At least water we don't have to worry about. That I'll put in here. And drop off a bunch of that water. We'll keep two. Drop one of those in there. Oops, wait. I'm going to drop that off, too. Let's keep three water. And the gold should have gone in there. Copper. Oh, cool. see, we got a nice little view. You see the fishies swimming by. You can see the beacon for the guy we're not going to rescue. <laughs> no, why do I keep going in there? I want in here. Okay, that stuff can stay in here. The fish can stay in here. Actually, we better cook one of these guys. Getting a little on the hungry side. So he gives us 32 food. So that's not bad. This gives us 30 water. It's alright, so we're in good shape there. So it's definitely worth it doing the disinfected water. You get a lot more for your effort. 
so we know how to build the advanced rank kit now. A lot of chunk messages and a whole fish. <laughs> all right. Well, that's it for today. We have done all we can do, but at least we've got a little habitat going. We know how to build our, our wiring uh, thingamajig. Um, our battery charger, sorry. And so once I get some silver, we can get that made, and then we'll be able to recharge our battery. We'll have, uh, you know, some good things going. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, tickle that thumbs up button for me. If you haven't already, please subscribe as well, and we will see you next time.